Long ago in the heavenly realms, Goddess Parvati, the consort of Lord Shiva, wished to create a companion for herself. One day, while Shiva was away, Parvati made a decision that would change the course of history. Parvati decided to create a son who would be loyal and devoted to her. She thought he would be a companion while Shiva is away. Mixing the grime of her body with the clay, she creates an idol of a boy. With happiness, with satisfaction, she creates and creates and creates her Ganesha, her creation, her son. Parvati breathes life into the idol and Ganesha was born. Parvati calls him Ganesha and he is always at her service. Parvati wants him to stand outside the entrance of her chambers and do not let anyone come inside without her permission. Ganesha assures her that I will not let anyone come inside the chambers. And then Shiva enters. But Ganesha do not let him enter. Shiva asks him, Who are you? And asks him to get aside. But he was given instructions not to let anyone enter. And Ganesha was very rigid. He did not recognize Shiva. And Shiva was very furious. The argument escalated and soon a battle broke out between Shiva and Ganesha. Despite Ganesha's bravery, he was no match for the mighty Shiva. In a fit of rage, Shiva struck Ganesha with his trident, severing his head. Parvati was devastated seeing body of her son. She blamed Shiva. Shiva did not know about Ganesha, but he promised Parvati that he will make everything right. Shiva sends Nandi to bring head of the first living creature he sees facing towards the north. And then Nandi and Bringi came up with a head of an elephant. They placed the head near Ganesha and Shiva breathes life into that head and this is how Ganesha was born a new Parvati was happy to see her son alive and Shiva promised that from now onwards you will be worshipped before all the gods for your courage and loyalty. gives a challenge to Kartike and Ganesha. One who encircles the earth three times and returns earlier will be declared the winner and will be given a special fruit of immortality. Further, Parvati explains them that it is not always about the speed, it is about the wisdom. Kartike was in rush to win the race, but Ganesha was clever. He tells his parents that you are whole universe to him and by encircling you both, 
he will have encircled the whole earth and he encircles his parents Parvati was sure that Ganesha understood the deeper meaning of the challenge. Kartike came and asked for the prize. But Shiva told him that your brother has already won the challenge. Kartike was angry. He said that I did not see him leave. Then how come he is the winner? Shiva explained him the whole story and Kartike understood that it's not always about the speed but about the wisdom